fresh meal one liter okay that's it Okay, so guys, today I am really going out for real now. Uh, so what is today's mission? So, um, well, my wife uh, just sent me out with a list of groceries. And speaking of which, where's the, where's the list? Okay, the list is here. And uh, um, but before I head to the grocery to, to the supermarket, I'm gonna drop by my mom's place and pass her pass her these. All right, uh, these these face masks. Tana very kindly helped us source this this pack uh, these this uh, these this uh, supply of face masks, and I help I was ordered some. So I've ordered one pack for myself and uh, and and sent an extra pack for my parents okay so right now what i'm going to do is i'm going to head over to my folks house drop these masks all right uh to at their place and at the same time also take the opportunity to start and drive the waja whilst leaving the e39 over there okay um yeah i mean honestly i miss uh, as much as i miss uh, as a whole i miss driving and i especially miss driving these two cars of mine so yeah i'm just gonna enjoy this um i'm not going to be cutting this video so you'll be seeing me driving the whole duration okay uh oh my god i i still see i'm seeing really very very little amount of cars out here okay uh, yeah so uh, what's gonna happen later when I reach my parents house um, we are not even going to meet each other what's gonna happen is I already called ahead asked my mother to put the wajas key uh, outside on uh, at the compound okay so what I'll do is once I once I get there uh, I'll take the waja out and I'll leave this face mask together with the e39's key at their at their uh, at the porch for them to to pick up later on okay then after that I will then head to the supermarket to pick up the groceries that I need and push straight head home to shower and clean up and all but I'm gonna do I'm going to also take the opportunity to enjoy this moment I missed driving the six cylinder engine I mean, honestly, right? Technically speaking, there it actually isn't wrong per se. You, you aren't technically wrong to go out. You are not infectious because as you are, if you are sitting inside the car, right, isolated within the confines of the car, you are not uh, a danger in transmitting the virus to anyone. But see the, 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 the but the movement control order is such that if we do not restrict even these small movements to the bare essentials then what happens is a lot of us will just uh, there will be a lot of people who will just still take the opportunity hit the road and we do not know which travel which is which person is going out for essential errands and which person is going out with and actually going to meet someone we don't we don't want that and we don't actually want pe and the whole point is we don't want people to meet and interact with each other even like yesterday when tana dropped these masks was it, yeah yesterday when tana dropped these masks at my house what what i told him was and we spoke at a distance about three four meters apart we never got closer than three or four meters apart so at that time i remember i was setting up the the swimming pool for my daughter my s max was parked outside so i told tana tana just 
put those masks on the SMX windshield uh, and, uh, and I went and collected like 15-20 minutes later after that. Yeah, so this is a very, we are at a very critical point, critical juncture in the, in this, um, in our, I, I dare say in our history. Okay, so we have to, we have to get this right. We can't afford to screw this up. Yeah, so let's just, let, I mean, I, I mean, okay, I, I'm just seeing a couple out there, uh, uh, two people walking there, but one of them is an elderly gentleman and the other is a, is a, is a, is a lady probably in her 30s or 40s, alright, uh, I mean, it's in this kind of thing, it's easy to pass judgement, but before we, we say that, we actually don't know what is the story of those two people, are, may, are they father and daughter, are they uncle and niece, or maybe... The, the the man the old man is somebody living alone and her his kind neighbor uh, is just walk walking with him walking him out to do his groceries as well so we do not know that uh, we try not to judge I try not to judge but uh, yeah we at the same time just let's let us all just do our part and and most important in the spirit of it stay isolated from everybody else I think now the, the important mindset within us to hold that we should hold is we should assume that we are already carrying the virus and that our strategy is to ensure that we don't expose ourselves for fear of infecting other people that way that way I think once you have that mindset in us then our 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 social containment measures would become immediately more effective and oh god god this six cylinder engine i miss driving this car i miss driving this car oh, oh it's, this engine is just purring Our movement control order is already what? It's already been a week since our movement control order, and how's everybody doing at home? I mean, you guys, you guys okay? You guys coping up okay? Right? Uh, I mean, if you, you, I mean, if you, you guys, uh, you, this is a good time, right? I mean, if you got, you, if you are feeling lonely at home, if you are feeling uh, a little depressed at home. One way to do one good thing you can consider is maybe you can just you know pick up your phone, uh, call your friends, call your family, call your relatives, uh, or if you are staying with your family, all the better. Right now, it's time to, to actually put down your phones, right? Uh, ironically, put down your phones and uh. And talk with the people in front of you, right? Uh, catch up with with them if you have if you have not been talking with your family members recently. Catch up with them and ask them how they've been doing. What's 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 uh, what was going on with your lives before your before before this whole movement control order uh, came in. Guys, let's do this. Let's 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 do this. Uh, we can beat this. We can. We absolutely can beat this. You 
even as I'm driving on these empty roads, one thing I, I notice is that, uh, especially this area where there are trees, the dead flowers, the dead leaves are all over the floor, uh, not being swept away, and this really brings into focus all the contributions of the unsung heroes of societies, all the cleaners, all the all the tukang sapu sampa, and all the all these guys. You know, they have been the ones. Uh, their hard work, their dirty work, have been the ones that keep our society going. So I've reached my mom's house. And yeah, so I just park the car and catch up with you guys again later. Hello, old friend. So I'm gonna put this down. Okay, so just dropped the E39 off and I'm heading off in the Waja to run my errands. And did I bring that shop? Damn shop. Okay. Right, so. Ah! Uh, I'm just driving this one too. An old horse for still still has plenty to give. The, it, it, it's you know it, the powertrain, right? It's, it, it's this powertrain. Uh, it still feels very energetic. It has an energetic feel to it. Traffic light, lights red. Actually, is it green? Oh no, it's not. It's not green yet. Sure, hell, sure hope we pull through this. By faith, we'll pull through this. We will pull through this. COVID-19 crisis really has thrown a spanner in the works for many things, right? Uh, many plans. And you know, just that Saturday before the movement control order was, was implemented, um, there was somebody who was supposed to come and view the Waja. And I told him, I said, you know, uh, let's call this off. Uh, we'll wait and I mean I'll keep you in mind we'll keep each other's number but we'll only I'll only uh, we'll only proceed and, and meet up after after the uh, you know after this whole COVID-19 case settles down in fact I, did, I, I told him at that time uh, he was he, you are welcome to view the car okay uh, to just look but I was not letting allowing any test drives but then two days after that, the movement control order was issued. So that put pace to all that. And it also scuppers my plans. Uh, you know, there was certain, there were, I, I mentioned before, 
there were things in this car that I wanted to fix. Maybe I'll do a walk around uh, of all the uh, the flaws in this car, show you all the, some of the flaws of this car that that I will need to address before I actually put it before I actually put it on the market. Okay, but off the top of my head, I can tell you the paint needs a it definitely needs a repaint. It needs a new uh, drive belt pulley. It needs a need this. Um, well, these are the two major items. I've got the air conditioning fixed. Uh, look, I can see that I need new wiper blades. The, I need a, le a new left front fog light. All minor, minor fixes, but uh, it's just that, you know, in my busy schedule, I have, I, I, I have not had time to look into all these things. See you after this. Okay. So I've got what I need. I need three items there. So what, what was it, uh, how was the shopping experience like? Uh, yeah, I never thought when I started this channel, grocery shopping would be one of the topics, but such are the times that we are living in now. So um, you can see that everybody, uh, this, when uh, in the supermarket, right, so I just went to the nearby gi small giant near my house. Everybody seemed to be a bit more mindful with, uh, with the person uh, next to them, with the space around them, so sun, so everybody seems to be, you know, like oh, we walking past a crowded aisle. Everybody is like, just when they see another person coming, you just like try to give 
uh, try to siam aside, just try to give everybody some extra breathing room. Uh, not everybody wore masks, but to me that that uh, I'm, I'm not going to be too bothered about that. Uh, I mean, seriously, some there there are there there. I mean, as we all know, right, a lot of shops have mask shortages. So if you don't have a mask, means you don't have a mask. Um, what can you do? And you and your life is to go on. You still need to go and do your daily things. Okay. Um, but uh, yeah, so I, I, I got my stuff out and uh, checked, went to the checkout counter, paid by credit card, paid using, using uh, used, used PayWave, and uh, so now I'm home. In fact, actually, right, you know, do you know the thing is, my 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 cash supply actually is running low, so I have very very little in terms of a cold hard physical cash in my wallet and, and my wife's wallet, and this was just before the lockdown when we were like okay maybe maybe in this couple of days i'll go to the atm but they've gotten around to that so uh yeah i'm trying to rely on on more electronic payment as much as possible um, try one try to limit our contact with with uh with you know surfaces that other people will touch and this has been a very interesting experience thus far so, well, it looks like a storm is cup is brewing. Anyways, I'm home. Uh, I'm gonna leave the car parked outside for now. I hate parking my cars outside, but this time around, I'm gonna leave the car parked outside. All right. Um, the idea is that maybe later in the afternoon, maybe after the storm, the 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 storm uh, dissipates. There'll be a bit of sun that would give a bit of heat in the car to well maybe i don't know disinfect it i don't know whether it works but it's sure as hell worth a try okay and yeah so anyways guys uh once again stay safe okay and uh i'll catch you in the next video cheers